Paxos unveils yield generating stablecoin Lift Dollar. Hostel is issued in the UAE and regulated by the Financial Services Regulatory Authority FSRA of Abu Dhabi Global Market App. Paxos Lift Dollar offers users a programmatic daily rate of around 5%, aligned with returns on U.S. Treasury bonds. Hostel is regulated by the Financial Services Regulatory Authority FSRA of Abu Dhabi Global Market M. Cryptocurrency trading platform Paxos has introduced a yield-generating, USD-denominated stablecoin called the Lyft Dollar Ustil, regulated in the United Arab Emirates UAE, the company said on Wednesday. The stablecoin is issued by Paxos International, the firm's UAE division, and regulated by the Financial Services Regulatory Authority FSRA of Abu Dhabi Global Market, M. The largest stablecoin issuers, such as Tether and Circle, gather billions of dollars worth of interest on the T-bills they hold, which has led to the creation of several yield-sharing stablecoins and blockchain-based U.S. Treasury products. Paxos CEO Charles Cascarilla said the new Lyft dollar is structured the same way as the other stablecoins issued by his firm. PayPal USD Piest, Pax Dollar, USP and Pax Gold Pax. These are match one, one with dollars, backed by short-term U.S government securities and all are overseen by a prudential regulator with all assets safely positioned remote from a potential bankruptcy situation, he said. We've added programmatic daily yield so this looks a little bit more like a savings product than a checking account product, which is maybe the way to think about traditional stablecoins, Cascarilla said in an interview. Hustle is going one step further from democratizing access to dollars to also democratizing the risk-free rate in the safest manner possible. Paxos Ustil will not be available in the U.S. because of a lack of regulatory guidance. At launch, Ustil will be particularly focused on Argentina, where it will be available to consumers via distribution partners Ripio, Buenbit and Tienda Crypto, according to a press release. For the launch, we're foregoing the 30 basis points bips of our asset management fee. So we're only holding back 20 bips meaning users will get more than 5%, Deus said in an interview.